What an atmosphere there is here in the Millennium Stadium ahead of the grand final and, well, at the start of this meeting at 7 o'clock, you would not have thought that Chris Harris would have been in the final. I was hoping maybe that he could get into the semi kelf but to get this far is fantastic! Yeah, fabulous effort from Chris Harris tonight. Can he go on and win this evening? I'll tell you what, the roof is going to be blown off the Millennium Stadium if he does manage to do it. Lee Adams is going off the inside, the noise is deafening! Adams off the inside, Chris Harris off gate two in blue, Greg Hancock gate three in white, and Jason Crow goes off the outside in yellow. The top two scorers, Adams and Harris, 14 points apiece, off the inside two gate positions. For me, though, Crump will take some stopping off gate four. Yeah, gate four's been working well. He has got to make a really good jump and get across, and if he manages to do that, he's going to be mighty tough to beat. Well, it's very tense, and the atmosphere is electric. We're in the grand final. Oh! oh we're to the start, and that was Greg Hancock and the red yeah, lights are on. Greg Hancock there was impatient, just shows you there, even though Ward is experienced. Watch it again. Drops a clutch early. Oh, oh, he's oh, he's lucky not to touch the tape. Exactly, shot. he's got away with it. All four back. And his pit crew there, just waiting anxiously. If Chris Harris can win this, it would be such a massive boost for British Speedway. Four laps of action. Hang on to the edge of your seats. What a because start. Hancock has made the start, and Chris Harris is last. But he's coming through now into third, and into second as well. Chris Harris battling with Jason. Oh, he's out, oh, of, shape. He's out of shape there. Oh, he's well out of shape. He's gone from second nearly to the back into third place. Fabulous start from, from the Greg. inside! Fabulous start from Greg Hancock there from gate three. Oh, Chris Harris up in the second spot. Oh, this is unbelievable. Hancock looking comfortable, but Chris Harris is still there. He's still going for it. Crump is third, and Harris is wheel to wheel with Hancock. Oh, he once again. How does he miss him? Whoa, wonderful throttle control from Chris Harris. Go, Chris Harris. Greg Hancock, though, he's an experienced campaigner. He's going to have to ride all over the track to stop him. One lap to go. Come on, Chris Harris. Down the back straight he goes. And Hancock looks over his shoulder. Yes. Watch out for this here. This is magnificent. And Chris Harris. Harris. Oh, that's oh, that's right. yeah. What a ride from Chris Harris. Look at the place, has gone absolutely wild. He won a move on the last corner to turn back up the inside. Sensational ride from Chris Harris. Have we ever seen a Grand Prix final like that, Kelvin Tatum? I, I have not witnessed anything like it. He's had seven Ooh. rides tonight. He's only made one start out of seven. Wonderful performance. Absolutely remarkable. We've seen... You know, and you've got to say the crowd, they've been entertained. Look, they've gone absolutely wild and absolutely rightly. This man has really entertained them tonight. A young man who started as a grass track rider and he had to make a choice between grass track and speedway. I think he's made the right choice, hasn't he? <laughs> Just about. You've got to say, in his first fully fledged season in the Grand Prix, he has been a revelation. He's had a third and now he wins his home Grand Prix. This place, nobody's going to leave here. You've got to say, it's been a, just a sensational night of Speedway. One that will live long in the memory. And Chris Harris has been absolutely outstanding.